All right, so to create our animated GIF process interaction or series of animated GIFs, uh, first thing we want to do is just record a process. Uh, I just recorded a simple process of making an espresso using this espresso machine. Uh, let's go ahead and see what we have. Uh, if we scrub through that, you can see that um, we go from grabbing a packet, uh, putting it into the machine, and then putting a cup in the machine, hitting it start, and watching the espresso come out, and then uh, consuming it or drinking it. So um, simple process. It's only a minute or so. That could probably be its own animated GIF, but we're going to cut it into a few, uh, two or three parts. So um, I'm just using the Windows 10 Photo Viewer. So if you don't have a video editor, ideally you're doing this in a video editor, you have more control. If you're not doing it in a video editor, you can just use the Windows 10 uh, Photo tool and you can see up here you can have Edit and Create. So we're going to go to Trim and let's go ahead and trim it. So we're going to find our beginning point. I don't need all of this open packet stuff, right? So I'm going to go right to where I have my um, my device here and I want to get rid of extra movement. So this is probably a good place. So this will be our starting point here. Let's just move that into our starting point here. This looks good. And we're going to find our end point. And you can see uh, we're just going to go to insert the filter and push that thing down. So we insert the filter and we push it down. And that's probably uh, a good point, good place to break that. So we've got that. Uh, let's go ahead and hit Save As. And then we're just going to overwrite the one I created. So 01, Insert Filter, and hit Save. Now if I want to insert another one, I'm going to come back to the video. We're going to go Edit and Create, Trim. And let's go ahead and find the start point here. Actually, I'm going to drag this over so it's a little easier to find it. So at this point, we'll just say um, take a cup here. We don't need the thumb part. So we'll just say take the cup and place cup under machine and turn on. All right, so then it turns it on. So we'll go ahead and hit Save As. Uh, we'll do 0, 2, cup on, hit save. Now we're going to get these little mini MP4s. And they're going to be easier to work with than trying to cut up this whole video into um, an animated GIF. Plus when you insert the animated the video into the animated GIF editor, it's going to bring out all the frames. So it's going to uh, increase the consumption of your system's memory. So the less you have to worry about when you're working with multimedia, the better. Uh, let's just do one more just to see how this works out for those uh, who want to learn. All right, so at this point we're going to say um, watch, watch coffee brew, right? So we've got this as our starting point. Actually, I need to go to Edit and Create. We're going to do Trim. And let's just go ahead and grab this here. I'm just going to grab this. And we're going to just turn on. And we'll say, okay, we're going to go here. We'll start from here. And then let's say the coffee brews. All right, and watch coffee brew. And that's probably all we need. And let's just do that. Let's save as. We'll do zero, 03 coffee. All right. And then the last one I might do is turn machine off. So at this point, we're going to edit and trim again. And let's go ahead and find this back end piece here and we're going to say coffee's done. Um, here we go. This looks like it's getting to the end point. And we're going to turn off. All right. And let's go ahead and hit save as. And we'll do 04 coffee complete off. All right, and so now we have four videos, and then we're going to be able to take those videos and insert those 
into our animated GIFs. So let's go ahead and open one of the videos up to make sure that it actually worked the way we wanted it to. All right. And I can see that I have these videos. I'm just going to click on one. And that's opening the video up here. I can see that it's uh, playing the way I want it to play. So there it is. So we're going to convert these to animated GIFs. So we created um, some little mini videos from one longer process video. And we didn't even really have to use a different app. We just used the app that comes with Windows 10. And as you can see, it's a pretty straight, straightforward process.